Welcome to the results summary of the first nine months of 2018 for Ferrovial. Infrastructure keeps performing well. Actually, it performs in an excellent manner, much better than what we expected one year ago when we had the uh, Capital Markets Day for Sintra. Growth in traffic and EBDA is outstanding in the 407 ETR and the managed lanes in Texas. We also opened, just opened in, uh, in this quarter, the NT3A, 3B also in, in Texas, and is growing more than anticipated. Ramp up is really accelerating, excellent performance. In terms of um, airports, uh, we have uh, Heathrow with record traffic and uh, high customer satisfaction with uh, growth in a BDA that is uh, helped by the retail uh, commercial initiatives uh, and also cost contention. In terms of AGAs, Aberdeen, Glasgow and Southampton, we see some pressure in traffic, but the BDA is, is growing also thanks to initiatives both in cost control and um, commercial uh, retail. In terms of dividends, they are already providing more than 400 million uh, euros up to date in, in, in dividends uh, for the parent. When we look into contracting, uh, we have construction with margins um, improving a bit, 2.1% EBIT to sales as we were predicted uh, along the year. But um, pressure in terms of cost remains uh, important, in particular in, uh, in Poland, also in the US. In uh, services, on the other hand, uh, we have Spain with uh, solid performance, uh, slight growth and uh, good margins. And in Amy in the UK, we see a 2% uh, BDA uh, to sales margin, ex Birmingham, taking out the, the Birmingham provision. And this is helped in part by the incorporation of contracts with Carillion since um, September. For the remainder of the year, we should also see an, uh, an improvement uh, here. Pro Spectrum is uh, trading in line with uh, expectations in terms of margin, a little bit slow in terms of uh, uh, adding uh, new um, contracts, but uh, the pipeline remains uh, uh, there. In terms of net cash um, uh, position, we have a net cash position north of 900 million euros. And this is held by the uh, dividends from infrastructure and also from some divestments in services close to 100 million uh, euros. And that we have to remind that we've been um, uh, directing something like 300 million euros to uh, uh, shareholders remuneration, dividends and, and buyback. In the end, the performance um, of the infrastructure is really encouraging. Uh, we're looking uh, forward to stabilizing the uh, contracting uh, um, results and uh, outlook therefore remains uh, positive.